To search Salem Press, go to the library's homepage, select the Articles and Scholarly Resources tab in the middle of the page, and then in either the top or the bottom drop-down menus, you may select Salem Press. They're listed in both of those. Click Go to the right, and it will authenticate you through our Open Athens authentication system. That's just your LLCC login and password. If you've already logged in through your email uh, and authenticated that way, you typically will have direct access from off campus. Salem Press provides a single search box. They also have an advanced search option if you want to look for a particular topic. You can also scroll down and see all their encyclopedias and reference sources are categorized by subject. So we have a vast array of literature titles, many of them on spe specific authors or specific works. We also have a history section, a science section, health, and then a, a single entry under careers. For the history entries, uh, that may also be pertinent to other uh, courses besides just uh, history courses. We have countries, peoples, and cultures. So that would be good for sociology, criminal justice systems. We have a history series called Decades, in which they take various topics from each decade and provide encyclopedia entries for those. Defining documents in American history, those will be primary source materials, might be good for uh, composition um, papers, etc. So there's lots of great content here to explore. Once you've decided to use a particular resource in your course, you can provide students with a link to the entire encyclopedia, or you can provide access to a specific entry within that resource. Both are done the same way. So let's pick this Encyclopedia of Climate Change, the second edition. I will click on it. It will open up the online version of this encyclopedia, and you'll see all the entries for that encyclopedia are listed alphabetically. It also provides a search option to the left. If I would like my students to choose an entry of their own choosing, then I might just link to this whole encyclopedia and ask them to pick one or two to present to the class. To do so, I just select the URL at the top of the page, copy it, and paste it within my learning management system, whether that's Blackboard or Canvas, whichever you are using this semester. If you would like them to read a particular entry within an encyclopedia, for instance, if we're looking for something about the American Chemical Society, uh, just choose that one. The same process works. You'll see the URL has URL has changed. You will just select that URL. You would paste it within your learning management system. What will happen is once they're authenticated through Blackboard if or Canvas, once you provide a link to the URL, it should automatically keep them authenticated into this resource. And that is how you both search and use the embedded links for Salem Press.